Hi everyone, my name is Jason from Shisha in the UK and the sampling room, bringing you another episode of the sampling room. Today I'm going to do something else that is a little bit different. Um, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing um, a non-tobacco dip review. Now, don't forget... Before I forget, sorry. Mud jug. Now, as I say, I do like my dips, do like my tobaccos, but this is something that's just a bit different. Something I picked off the internet, um, off eBay actually, which you can buy on Amazon, eBay, or shop it off directly from their store. It's actually an American based thing, but you can get it quite easily in the UK. These two, Cowboy Coffee Chew and Major League Coffee Dip. It is one of those things that if you're quitting tobacco or quitting dip, it's quite a good thing to try out or if you just want to try something different and you're a dipper, or even if you're not even a dipper, it's quite something good to try. Now what it is, it's kind of pretty simple. It's ground up, I have got a lot left in this one. Ground up coffee with, I don't know, maybe some creamer added and some sugar. That's that one, they're pretty similar. I think the uh, make, the only difference is Let's just stick the light and see if that's going to make any difference. Right. There we go. The only difference is, I mean, this is a bit of the cowboy coffee chew. If you can see that, it's a bit shite. Lighting, sorry about that. And that's the Major League Dip. It's gone all over the floor. I think the Major League Dip possibly um, slightly coarser ground but it is a very good way to actually um, well to get a bit of energy I have tried this well I have tried the cowboy coffee chew before which is very very nice and that's why I've nearly finished that tin let's try some of the major league dip I've been told it tastes the same um, it definitely smells nearly exactly the same just make sure it smells exactly the same what you have to do, I mean look, it's a, that's how sticky it is and whatnot. It can come out in a solid chunk. Take a nice big chunk of it. Yeah, it's def definitely um, coarser ground. And the ma Major League uh, coffee dip is. It's kind of like uh, when you bake a perilla with a snooze, but you just, instead of that, you stick it into your bottom lip instead. Right, here we go. Oh, it can be quite harsh and I don't look very intelligent and won't I just put a lot in. <laughs> oh, I mean look, hold it in your mouth. Right. There we go. Radio. I've heard you can swallow, oh, well I have done anyway, in the past you can swallow, you spit quite well. It's only coffee basically coffee grounds and you can get a little bit of energy from it. It's not a lot, it's not like having an espresso or anything like that or having an energy drink. Oh man, the taste is phenomenal. It really is. I know it seems like, well, it's only what it's only a bit of coffee one, but no, this is really, really nice. Obviously you do get some caffeine in it. Uh, on the website it says, uh, this product has been commercially manufactured and sealed and it has been tested and verified consumption. Each tin contains 39 grams or 1.4 ounces of chew, and it is available in the USA. Way. Um, ingredients are fresh ground coffee, honey, sugar, and cream, just like a cup of coffee, thus a cup in a pinch. Not, recommend, uh, not recommended for those individuals are sensitive to caffeine and or coffee. Um, let's have a look on eBay. Uh, I did buy a big ton of them once, so it's quite cheap, and they are very good with the shipping prices as well, and very, very efficient. Um, I did buy, only buy, what did I buy? I think I bought six cans, just of um, three of each. I got quite a lot sent in the post, so they are very, very generous um, with their, obviously, their sending policies and whatnot. At the moment, it is listed, if you want mixed, uh, it's listed for three cans of Major League Coffee Dip, um, and three cans of cowboy coffee chew. That's six pack. International shipping. 
Um, don't worry, you won't really have any problems in customs. It's not tobacco and like that. That's for nine pound. Uh, sorry, nineteen pounds and ninety-seven pence. That sounds a lot, but I mean, pff, why not just give it a go? Well, I mean, I have been swallowing my spit, but spit incoming. Uh, that's say so you get you get like quite light to start um, spit doesn't really make any difference some people care about it but one thing I will say it's only been in for what about three or four minutes now starting to break up a little bit not too much so you kind of have to keep it packed in when well, I found what I've kind of kept it in for about 30 minutes before that's when it really starts to break up um, so the ends, so if you have a piece that's like solid like that, about a couple of millimetres either side will, you can't help that, you won't be able to keep it together. They will come out. At the end of the day, if you end up spitting them out, you end up spitting them out, there's no great bother. But you can't help. And you can see it in my lip there. So that's going to come away. You can't help but getting some coffee grounds around here. So it would be a good idea to obviously have a swig of... Oh. There we go. It's starting to come apart already. <laughs> when you're finished, definitely wash your mouth out, as you would do anyway with dip. But I can feel myself, I've got a little bit of energy from it. Not a lot, because I, I was tired anyway, but we do get a little bit of energy. But pretty much as soon as you're done with the dip, your buzz is gone, almost, well not buzz, but your energy buzz is gone almost immediately. I would definitely recommend giving this uh, a try out though. It's very in uh, very interesting, very nice taste, especially if you just, you can't be bothered to get, get some coffee or you know, if you're trying to quit tobacco or trying to quit dip or something like that, it is a good shout, I have to admit. So, thank you very, very much for watching. I say, oh, there's another downside as well. Unfortunately, it does stain your teeth a little bit. It's coffee at the end of the day. So thank you very, very much for watching. Any questions at any point um, or any comments or anything you'd like to see reviewed, leave it in the comments below. And as as well, check me out on all my um, social medias, uh, Facebook at Jason, no, sorry, not Facebook, um, Instagram at Jason GVL, Twitter at Jason GVL. Um, and Facebook is Shisha in the UK or just search for the sampling room as well. So thank you very much for watching. Give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.